So I'm Eric Brayman, the uh, HR manager here at the Pump House in uh, Rock Hill, South Carolina. Beautiful, beautiful new uh, casual fine dining restaurant uh, right on the Catawba River. Old building that was originally meant to uh, cool um, a chemical plant's machinery. This building used to pump water 24 hours a day uh, into this plant. There was over three miles of pipe running through the ground uh, in this area for 50 something years. Uh, quite amazing feat that they took these huge pipes out of the building, completely made it into a gorgeous dining facility. The cuisine at the Pump House is your classic traditional southern cuisine, but with a modern twist. It's something that, that the region really needed. Um, not just for Rock Hill, but for 20 miles in the surrounding vicinity. Um, there's nothing like this anywhere around here. Beautiful view of the river, uh, the rooftop bar. Chef does an amazing job of taking those classic dishes and local meats and produce and turning it into a new modern dish. Uh, like I said, just like the building, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty neat. Uh, the food, the building, the architecture of the building almost matches the architecture on the plate. Get a beautiful three, four hundred dollar bottle of wine, beautiful champagne, or you can come have a beer and some wings. You know, there, there's something for everyone. Uh, there's three levels of dining. Um, rooftop bar, beautiful view, but quite casual. The main dining room is that modern elegance with that old classic feel. It almost feels like it was a factory or a plant one day. And in the sense it was, it produced water. Uh, but now we produce wonderful food, deliver beautiful wines. Um, it is uh, a, a great, a great, great place for the, for the neighborhood. Hi, um, my name is Michael Griswold. I'm the executive chef here at the Pump House in Rock Hill, South Carolina. So my favorite dish uh, would have to be our Springer's Mountain Farm chicken dish. It's a two-day process where we take our chicken and we break it down from whole, utilizing every part and every uh, scrap piece um, to compile this dish together. We take the chicken leg and we cure it for two days and then we slowly confit it for a few hours, um, enabling it to uh, absorb all the wonderful aromatics and flavors to go with it. Um, and then the chicken breast itself, um, we French off the bone um, and then we brine it in our peach sweet tea and for about two days and then we marinate it in our herb marinade. Um, and then from there, we pan sear it, as well as the confit chicken leg. Serve it with a traditional Cajun rice, um, a play on uh, dirty rice, if you will. Uh, and it's served with our Carolina slaw with a Cajun Creole cream sauce. Um, it's got a little bit of uh, acidicness from the slaw with a little bit of spice from the sauce. Um, and a whole lot of flavor with the uh, confit leg and then just absolutely melt in your mouth chicken breast um, pan seared just sliced to uh, nice thin perfection. You can sit up there have a cocktail and watch the eagles fly by see the turtles swimming uh, it's 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 quite the place and it's uh, from what I hear from all the guests greatly needed in the area, so I'm glad to be part of the team.